Let's build a light switch ultra. I've gone ahead and I've laid out all of the parts that come in your kit. And as you can see, you get two lengths of standoffs and two lengths of stack screws. Now you're gonna make this decision before you build and it's gonna be based on whether you're doing a three layer stack or you're gonna do a super slammed build. Now once you've decided on which stack screws you're gonna use, you're gonna grab your mid plate and then you're gonna install those stack screws into the stack holes and they are 20 by 20 millimeter. And then you're gonna grab your M3 nylon nuts, install those and you're gonna repeat this three times until all of your stack screws are installed. Then you're gonna grab your vertical stiffeners and you're gonna get the side with the three little nubs and put it into the mid plate and then the side with the two notches goes into your bottom plate. Now, if you plan on running a thicker battery strap, it would be wise to install the battery strap right now. And I do that by just placing it in the battery strap slot in the vertical stiffeners, and then I sandwich it with the bottom plate. And now you can proceed to installing all four of your arms. You're gonna use your 16 millimeter countersunk screws and put those into the arms, and then the middle holes are gonna be your compression screws, which are your shorter countersunk screws. Now that we have all four arms installed, we're going to locate the standoffs that we wish to use for our build. You'll grab the 20 millimeter for a slim build or the 23 millimeter if you're going to be doing a triple layer stack. And there's no secret to this, just screw them on. And then there is one thing that we need to notice before putting on the top plate in that there is a shorter distance between the stack screws in the front standoff and a longer distance between the stack screws in the rear standoff. So the top plate front goes towards that shorter distance. And now if you order TPU parts, you're gonna get a camera mount, a turtle fin, and a universal antenna mount. This universal antenna mount kind of works like a zip tie. First, you'll grab your UFL and you'll put it through the hole and then you're gonna take the strap and put it over the antenna and through the middle slot. Now the easiest way I've found to install this is to kind of leave the antenna out of it Pull it enough that you get one set of teeth through and then you install the antenna from the side and then you kind of just judge if it needs any more tension on that strap and if it seems like it's fine you can go ahead and install it on the top plate. The two slide slots go over the little rear fingers on your top plate and then you're done. And now we can just slide our camera mount on, install our top plate and then start putting our screws in. The rear screws go in pretty easily and then the easiest way I've found to install the turtle fin is to pre-insert the screws into the turtle fin and then once they're already pre-aligned, they go down onto those front standoffs super easy. And there you have it, you have a light switch ultra. Go ahead, build it up, see how light you can get it and just get out there and fly. Thanks for watching.